Whoa, we had a new low. Let's check that again. Camera weighs a kilo. Sheesh. All right, scale's being fickle. Either way, sub 72. I think I had enough uh, water yesterday. Pretty sure I had just over eight liters. So maybe that's not enough of a, uh, maybe I didn't drink enough. Dropped too much water last night. Maybe my sodium wasn't high enough. I don't know, it's pretty significant. Oh, I know what it was. I only slept six hours on, uh, what's it? Sunday night and uh, last night. Wait, on Saturday night, so six hours. So I just woke up. Okay, so interesting thing is I woke up two kilos lighter today. On Saturday, I only got six hours sleep. So that'll always make a big difference for me. I retain a lot of water if I, uh, if I don't sleep that much. If I get a lot of sleep in, so it's, I woke up at 2 p.m. I went to bed, probably fell asleep around 3, 30. So a nice 11-ish hour sleep and dropped two kilos of water since yesterday. I got in about eight liters of water and around 4,000 milligrams of sodium yesterday. So definitely not a sodium flush or water flush. I guess I'll up it again today. Keep the sodium even higher. I don't really want to drop too much more. It's Monday now, so Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday is going to be a mild carb up. I got to stay lean for the show on Sunday. But overall, pretty stoked. I was expecting to come in at uh, 71.5 for the show, but it looks like I might even be sub 70 or 70 ish range. It's pretty ridiculous because in 2014, I weighed uh, 60, no, sorry, 2013, I did a bodybuilding show and I weighed. I just came in under 70, like struggling hard. And uh, right now I feel like if I had to go under 70, wouldn't be that big of a deal. So I don't know, I'm feeling great for some reason. This prep hasn't been that difficult. Uh, I have been uh, dropping calories around 2200 average and one refeed day of about 2800 so my calories haven't been that low and uh, I just added in cardio I never done cardio before maybe that really makes a difference just usually dieted through calories never had to go below 2000 except for peak week and that was just to push a little bit harder but uh, I guess from now on I'll definitely be doing cardio the last four weeks of the show ridiculous I'm getting so tight and prepping for uh, over 20 weeks helps too. Do multiple shows. So that's always good to line up. I think I'll try that again next year. I don't know. Mm, I think I still need to grow some. Especially in the delts. Stupid delts. Gotta blow those suckers up. Anyways, this is a long clip now. So uh, let's start the day with some food. I am starving. Yo, here we go. Welcome to day four. Feeling pretty good. Hello, Natty Light. That looks pretty sweet. But let's check some LED. Boom! That'd probably look better if I had some protein on, right? Wash me out. So bright. But, feeling good. Delts looking good. Hit delts in chest yesterday. Did my hit training. Got some flabby rolls down here. That's your skin, look at it. Sticking. Ha! All right, let's see what it looks like. Down. Pretty good. Overall, I'm happy with this package. 
this is what I'm gonna bring to the stage on Friday because I'm not gonna change anything I don't need to I've messed up before by trying to do some crazy peak week strategies, dropping water, flushing sodium, adding potassium, taking dandelion root, all that stuff. And uh, show day, sometimes I looked a little bit better, but sometimes I've really screwed myself. So this past competition I did two or three weeks ago, a month ago, August 30th, three weeks ago, that uh, I definitely spilled over and I was eating too many carbs and listening to all these different people who were there they were supporting me I really appreciate it but uh, it was it was messing with my head and, and I wasn't sticking to my actual game plan so this time I don't care I gotta drink water at the show uh, I'm not gonna drain sodium or anything I'm not gonna carb load I'll just have like a mild meal, which means 150 to 200 grams. And uh, that's so I don't also spill on Sunday. On Sunday, I'd like to try maybe carb loading a little bit harder, push for around 350 to 400 grams, which is not much. That's like a, if I'm in a surplus, that's like a daily average of carbs. But I haven't been eating more than 100 grams past week or so so I need to uh, keep them low I find that if I go over 200 I, I, I just get flat the next day unless I pump up a ton so I'm not gonna have time to do that nor will I have the accessibility to like good facilities so just gotta come in tight and that's what I'm gonna do I'm trying to still find someone who I can borrow some equipment from to get a good pump, I realized that 15, 20 minutes of pumping sucks, and it's not. For me, I do volume training. I uh, was talking on Reddit the other day and saying how I train three to four hours, six to seven days a week. Someone's like, you train 40 hours a week? I call BS. I got downvoted. Beep, 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 beep. But uh, yeah, I do, so. Uh, and when I'm pumping up, I need about an hour Maybe an hour and a half would be better to really get a full, full look that, uh, that my body's capable of. So that's the game plan for Friday. Stick to what I'm doing now. Sunday, maybe we'll play around with some stuff because there's no big prize for that. It's just a showcase, and I'm going to be going up against like Korea's best men's physique athletes in the open class. So. Even if I place top five, that would be some kind of miracle in, in that show. <laughs> Especially since they're all, boom, yeah. So anyways, I'll see you guys over at the food. Same old meal as the other day, marinated pork, 600 grams, 400 grams of cherry tomatoes. And over there we got thawin. 500 grams of chicken breast for later tonight. I think I might swap that out with the squid and cook it in this marinade sauce. This stuff was a little bit tough yesterday, so I'm gonna blend it up in a blender with an egg and then fry it as little patties in the fry pan. I think that'll be pretty tasty. So I've changed it up a little bit. Gonna be doing fresh asparagus. It was like one white asparagus thrown in there in that package. 160 grams. The 600 grams of marinated pork. I'm gonna save that marinade for later with the squid. And I'm gonna be baking little sambops. The cherry tomatoes, I'll save those for later or the girlfriend can have them. So, this time I learned my lesson and sprayed some cooking oil on this pan beforehand. I did that squid on here last night you guys watched the day five video and uh, cleaning this thing was terrible it's got all kind of burned stuff I thought it was uh, just the soy sauce charring but it was the all the other sauce and stuff that was on there just burned into the pan so I had to do a little cleansing afterwards anyways that's looking real good 
So this will be meal number one. Make some little wraps. And off to the gym. I gotta finish working on my clients, um, my US clients macros and, and diet plans for the week. And then also um, their workout regimes. And do that every Monday. And overall, Yeah, I don't know what I'm saying. Nom nom nom. Looking pretty good. Greens and meat. My favorite. Just got a sweet new phone case. Boom. Here's the piece now. Decent, but keeps cracking the screen. And paying for that is outrageously expensive. So let's check out what the finished product looks with the new screen protector and case. It's pretty dope. Amira. Bam! Too bad it wasn't a sponsored product. Let's check it out on the phone. Oh, there we go. Finished product. It's pretty good. Yay! I find that I keep breaking my phones in the gym, so this was a definitely much needed upgrade. Something thick. And that I can throw around and have no problem with. Sweet! Man, F my life. All this stuff. Drin and put oh even the shoes. And that box is real. And that fruit. Yep, I already poured it all out on the floor in the subway. I can't wait to clean this. I'm so tired. I just want to eat. And that was my post workout food. Talk about hangry and fatigued. Just struggles. Just struggles. 600 grams of squid and I blended it up. It's like ground chuck. Mm -hmm.